Hey gamers, I am Cybersnake7, hope we're all well guys, back again with another video and yes I'm standing in front of the Super Nintendo collection, so you guessed it guys, this is going to be the April edition of the Year of the SNES and I'm going to add another great game to the collection, this is going to be game 133. Uh, and it's another heavy hitter to tick off the list, which I've wanted for a while now. I say heavy hitter because it's a very, very difficult game to find, boxed and complete, and in good condition, full stop. It's such a hard game to find. Um, it is on PAL format also, um, but usually you'd find that the PAL format would be harder to find and more expensive, but this time round, the NTSE version is definitely the superior. It's so hard to find, so difficult to track down, and for a good price. So... Very happy to have this. I sourced this off a good friend of mine and I paid a reasonable price for it. But when you see the condition it's in, it's money well spent as far as I'm concerned. So guys, let's have a look at game 133. Now this game I've never owned before, never played before. And it's a side-scrolling beat-em-up. And that game is this one. It is Legend. And as you can see, this box is in primo condition. There is not a blemish, not a mark, not a scratch on it. It is in quality condition. But as I say, I paid £150 for this, but money well spent as far as I'm concerned because it's another fantastic title. And as I say, one I've never played before anyway. So absolutely fantastic, fantastic condition. Couldn't be happy with that. But there you go. There's the box, guys. Right. Now we'll have a look at the units as per usual. So as we start off, we get the usual spiel, which is the precautions leaflet for the Super Nintendo. And then we've got a questionnaire, which is actually from the makers of the game. And then we have a poster. So let's have a look at the poster. Never looked at the poster before, so it'll be interesting to see what it is. So we have, uh, it's a game I picked up at the beginning of the year, and it's one of my Grail games. One of the easily my Grail games in the collection, for just not from a Super Nintendo, but full stop the game in my, in my room. Uh, and it's Super Torrican 2 poster. Um, I absolutely love this game it is so bloody difficult and so expensive to get now though unbelievable I was very lucky to pick it up I did pay extortionate for it but at the end of the day it's something I wanted for years so there you go guys there's the Super Torican poster and on the back of this poster is a bit about the game itself which is legend and it gives you a little backstory and a few screenshots about the game itself so that's a pretty interesting little poster so I'll fold that back up pop that back where it belongs in the box in a bit so finally we have one instruction manual and as you can see yet again a couple of finger marks on the back but what do you expect you know what I mean people are going to look through these things but apart from that it is in quality condition so very happy with that and then finally guys is the usual which is the cartridge so let's take it out of its bag and it does have its protective cover, as per usual. Always happy to see one of them. But well, there's the cartridge, guys. And yet again, it is in absolutely top condition. Not a blemish, not a mark on the actual label itself. Cartridge-wise, no discoloration. Pins are absolutely pristine. And the back, yet again, no discoloration, absolutely perfect so there you go guys there is a legend the cartridge and the game itself uh absolutely as i say chuffed to get this game absolutely fantastic so what i'm going to do with this um i ain't done it for a while i'm going to sit down and i'm going to give a go of the first level of this game um it's a pretty uh difficult game apparently it's it's got a little bit of tactics to it to be honest it's just not a straightforward bash your way through the levels you've got to have a little bit of tactics and block a lot because they will kick your ass basically so i'm not expecting to get through the first level but i'm going to give you guys a, a quick look at the game and see how it plays and uh, we'll leave it there so guys thanks for watching and uh, i'll see you in the next video but before we leave let's take a look at this game in action so as always guys i am cyber snake 7 keep playing keep watching all the best Okay guys, so let's take a look at Legend. Let's see what it's all about, shall we? As I say, I've never played this game before, so it's the first time for me. But um, yes, as I said, it's 
pretty tactical little side scrolling beat look you've really got to block a lot otherwise you'll be overrunning it's game over to technically so uh, let's uh, let you look through this little bit of a story guys and then uh, we'll crack on with the game itself it on easy yes I'm wimping out but it's not supposed to be an easy game so um, you know it is my first time after all right stage one the beginning of the quest cross the forest and find the old wizard okay so you get the controls normal hit you throw something and block is L and R really got to time these blocks and you must pick everything up you see I think because I think it builds up your energy plus one as well jump button yep yeah, gotta jump jump and a kick nice one So far, but as I say, no doubt she's going to get pretty damn tough. There you go, there's the block. Very much needed in this game. say about it it's uh, a pretty slow paced game which is not a bad thing but you, you gotta understand he's swinging around a big massive club sword so but yeah pretty impressive graphically really good typical side scrolling beat look and there's no wrong with that also Don't make it past this level, please understand. For some reason, we've got half energy. Which I don't quite understand. Which is uh, not a bad thing. I suppose that's because we've got it on easy. And I still ain't gonna do very good at Thank you. 
Oh, well, there you go, guys. Um, right then. Far more practice is needed. So, that's just a quick look at the first level, guys, of uh, the Mighty Legend. Fantastic game. Absolutely loved it. So happy to have in the collection. So, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll leave it there. And I will see you in the next episode or next month's episode of the Year of the SNES. So, thanks for watching, guys. As always... I am Cyber Snack 7. All the best guys. <laughs>